Hey guys, I've got an interesting video for you today. So I was streaming on Twitch and I was getting a bunch of questions about my name, sniping, where it all started, how to get better and stuff like that. And I found it pretty interesting. I think you guys will find it interesting. I get asked in the comments a lot about like how do you get better and wh what's my name mean and stuff like that. So I answer all that in this video. So just like my other Blackout videos, I'm going to cut out all the dead boring stuff. Uh, it's just going to be interesting gameplay, interesting conversation. I think you guys will like it. I, I think it's pretty dope. So... With that said, I hope you guys enjoy, and I will see you on the next video. Um, this is really bad. Um, uh oh. Who threw this? Oh, you threw it! Ow! Holy shit, I didn't even see him sitting there in the corner. There's a guy like right here. Who's next? I don't think anybody else is here. I think I'm all good. The rest of the place is for me. Did you first gain sniper skills from Overwatch? Oh, fuck no. No, absolutely not. If anything, Overwatch made him worse. No, yeah, no, 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 no. I was quick sniping before quick sniping was a thing. I, I quick sniped on a game called SOCOM. Like, years and years and years ago. Back on the PlayStation 2. Long time ago. Yeah, no, if anything, if anything, Overwatch made my sniping worse. Further collapse expected. Travel to indicated safe zone. Wow, you little fucking wiener, dude. Nice. Hey, no problem, dude. I've kind of gotten into it before. I've explained it. I can explain again. So back in the day, like PlayStation 2 is when I started. And there was a game called SOCOM. It was a first person shooter. Sorry, it was a third-person shooter, but it was kind of special, so obviously it was an old game, PS2, like, that's forever old, right? But if you wanted to snipe in that game, then you had to be stationary. It wouldn't let you scope in if you were moving. So you had to stand still and snipe, but there was a glitch that if you jumped, you could scope and shoot. So what people would do is they would go like this, so if there's a sniper in front of me, there's a guy trying to fight me, you would you would do this you jump and scope in that that's how you would quick scope in that game you'd go like that every single time so back in the day like that was like way before call of duty that's before it's a long time ago so that was before i ever even heard of quick sniping and that's what i did in that game i got known for that so i played on a team and i was like the sniper like i played the sniper on my team and that's what i did and I got really good at it. And then when PS3 came out, I bought Call of Duty 4. The first Modern Warfare, the very first one. And I learned how to quick scope on that game. And then, yeah, I basically, ever since then, I've just sniped in every single game I've ever played. Overwatch is a little bit different. Overwatch is like, it's a lot more slower. So like, you, Overwatch, you scope in, you gotta charge your shot to 100. Once it hits 100, then you can shoot, right? So it's slower. And the aim system is unlike any other game I've ever played. So it, it was really difficult to, to get used to it. I'm sure you, you've noticed. Like, every other first-person shooter, it feels good. Like, everything feels the same. You can play literally any first-person shooter, anything. It all feels the same. Overwatch, it's just wrong. It just feels off. This is not right. So it was like almost learning again. It was slower paced and, yeah. First ever, first ever quick scoper. I was, I was among them, man. I was among them. But bro, I, I did that shit before Call of Duty, and and lots of other people too. There were some really talented players that did the same thing I did. Is that what you got your name from? Yeah, I got it from SOCOM. So when you when you played competitive in SOCOM, 
you needed a verified account and in order to verify your account you needed a credit card they made you link a credit card to your account so people wouldn't just like have a million accounts right and they would all be ranked so what they did to stop that was you had to link a credit card to it but because I was so young I didn't have a credit card and my parents didn't want me to use their credit card for it so one of my teammates gave me their account and the account they gave me was back off my janks so ever ever since then uh, that's been my name I've been back off my janks for forever I feel like I've told that probably like I don't know I, I say that I have to say that story a lot but I think it's kind of cool I get asked what like what's a janks and stuff like that and I'm like bro I don't even know I have no idea what my name means all I know is some dude gave it to me <laughs> no matter how good you are there's always room for improvement Absolutely. And no matter how good you think you are, there's always somebody better. Think about it that way, too. No matter how good you think you are, you might believe that you're the best. There's always somebody better. Somehow, some way, there's somebody better. Alright. What room are you sitting in, bro? Oh, you're sitting in that room. Wait, what the hell? Where is he? He's in there. Oh my dude, you gotta learn to not oh shit, no 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 get out of my menu. Get out of my menu. Oh my god. That was a near miss, bro. Alright, where are you hiding at, dude? These little noodles be hiding in the... They be hiding in the brush, bro. Where you at? Bro, I'm about to let him hang and go loot this body anyways. Shoot at me again, dude. I dare you. I'm looting my body. You told it in a Q&A once? I never really went all the way back and like told like about how I started to play snipers and stuff like that. But I've sniped in every game I've ever played. And that's basically all I've done is played shooters. Okay, where the hell is this guy? Where are you? Oh, I found him! He's level 3! He's level 3! Ah! Ah! Chill! Chill! She's getting western out here, bro! Relax! No, no, no! There's another one! Ah! I'll be back for you in a second, bro! Oh my god, oh my god. I'll be right with you, hombre. Yeah, you. I'm coming for you. That booty. Did it feel good, though? Why? Now you're getting sniped at. How's it feel? Oh, man. How in the hell did I pull that off? Bro, I have no business being alive right now. I ain't even gonna lie. Do you like single player games? Uh, yeah, yeah, no. I don't really like grind out single player games. I like the competitive aspect. I like, I like outplaying people. Like that moment right there with those two guys, like that, I play games for that moment. Like, that's cool. The feeling you get is like, I don't know. That's what I like. I like that a lot. How long did it take for you to get good? Well, here's the thing, man. Play Hold on. Playing on console is a little bit different than playing on, say, PC, right? On PC, you're going to naturally get better, like, all the time. The thing with PC, a lot of it is muscle memory and, like, you move your mouse two inches and, like, on your mouse pad... Your, your arm gets a feel for that, so like you'll naturally improve. The thing with console is that it's hard to improve like drastically all the time. The thing with console is a lot of it is hand-eye coordination. And hand-eye coordination isn't something that you just learn. Like, hand-eye coordination comes with... How do I explain it? Um, like, it takes, it takes time. It takes a lot of time. Not necessarily practice, because like, 
I don't know. When I move my thumbs, it's like, it's not like I'm good at aiming, right? I'm just really good at hand eye coordination. I'm good at centering things in my screen fast. It's like, I don't know. You've probably seen my, my Widowmaker videos, right? Where I said how to get better with Widowmaker. Like, there's this little trick that I do. And it was me playing with no crosshair. You, did you guys see that video? Where I was, I was shooting people with no crosshair at all. You guys see that one? Yeah, you guys saw the video? So the video of me, it's like I turned my crosshair completely off. So I just had a naked screen. I had no HUD. It was just my, a naked screen. There's nothing to look at. <clears throat> and I was still able to hit my shots, like, really consistently. That's because it, I don't rely on a crosshair. I just know where center of my screen is, and I have the hand-eye coordination to... When, when my target is center of my screen, then I shoot. It's not... Dude, my man is skipping. When my target is in the center of the screen, then I shoot. I don't necessarily aim at people. What? I hit my shots without a crosshair rather than having it. <laughs> this game's a little bit different because there's travel time. And there's travel time and stuff like that. So you gotta like, you actually gotta aim where you wanna go. But at the same time, you just kind of like center your, you like you look at where you wanna shoot and then you shoot. You don't really aim where you wanna shoot. Does that make sense? I'm just adding this little bit here at the very end. First of all, thank you if you made it this far into the video. I really appreciate it. Um, but the way I was describing sniping and how I snipe and hand-eye coordination and stuff like that, I can go way more into detail. I didn't in the video and I didn't add anything on top of that. But if you think I should make a video like going really in, in depth with it, I can definitely do that. So let me know in the comments down below if you want me to do that. Thank you again if you made it this far. I really appreciate it. And I will see you guys on the next video.